I feel like niggas think I'm a bitch. I feel mm. like niggas think I'm a soft ass nigga. I think it's because I'm light skinned. You know, I get that. You feel me? I get the. Uh, Not because I'm light skinned. I think so. I get, <laughs> I get light discriminated. Yeah. I feel like I get light discriminated. Yeah. You feel me? You know what I mean? A lot of times. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know why. They think I'm soft. They think a lot of the, lot of the shit. But, and it's not that I'm trying to be hard. It's just I'm not soft. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a pussy. I'm not a buster. You know what I'm saying? We, we could take it there. And that was kind of like earlier in the career where it was like, all right, nobody even like kind of knows certain things. You feel me? And then I just like took it there. And it was just like, all right, bet. That's, that's what y'all feel? All right, for sure. Let's, let's let's go. Let's take it there. You know what I'm saying? And we're going to come flamed up. We're going to come doing everything. We, you know what I'm saying? We're going to come with that shit. And after the show, we're going to see what it is. But it wasn't that. I was on that. I don't think bro was on that. Bro was really about making some money. <laughs> yeah, so, so it was your ass didn't have an understanding. That's what I'm saying. One of you niggas didn't have an understanding. So it and was you yeah, that really I, did what there as far as mentally like, nigga, yeah, this is money. No, listen, I didn't understand the internet shit. Sometimes I still don't, you know? You know, I, sometimes I don't, I, don't, I don't get everything. Sometimes I just be like, nah, that ain't me. I ain't finna do that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And I didn't understand the 200 posts about, about me. I didn't mm-hmm. understand that. From a, from somebody from another rapper, I didn't understand that, I didn't get it, but he obviously did, and he was smart, and you know he did his thing, you know what I'm saying? And we owe a lot to Free O Three because we owe a lot to him too because he took it there as well, you know what I'm saying? And it at one point it escalated it, it to like so it was like okay where you at, bro? I thought it was gonna <laughs> get that bad, you know. But you know shout out Lil No, shout out Nosta, and shout out Mafia Horn. Cause you know they got us on the phone, and you know we we spoke about it, and it was like, all right, for sure. They like, nigga, if we gonna fight, we gonna if y'all niggas gonna fight, y'all gonna fight. But if we gonna get this bread. Let's just get this bread, fool. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And when they started talking about the money part, I was just like, you know what I'm saying? You're right. Now I get it. You feel you me? You think if if more rappers handled they beef the way you I, and Greedo did, it would work? Fifty piece, huh? You think if more rappers handled they beef like the way you and Greedo did, we have more unity? Um. Uh, yeah, it shows. Like, look at the uh, verses. Look at the verses now. Y'all was the first verses. For sure. Hold on. That was your first time getting a 50 piece. That was. That was my first time getting a 50 piece. The show? Yeah. Y'all got a 50 we, piece for that? I did. Two. And we had two shows. Oh, that's crazy. I didn't know that. Maybe I should go back to rapping. I'm just saying, it, it was a good time. You know what I'm saying? It was history made. No, it was. Made, you know what I'm saying? So it wasn't made. fake, because a lot of people thought that that was like a whole publicity stunt that y'all was on. Yeah, it wasn't no publicity. I don't know how to do publicity stunts. I don't know how to do those. Nah, I was there. There wasn't no publicity stunts. I don't stunt. know how to do those. Well, we'd have had her stunt our way up out that motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no everything. <laughs> um, but I'm glad it ended the way. I'm glad the outcome is what it is, you know? Mm-hmm. Because, you know, we was. We was cool before that. So that's what I don't be understanding. Like, you know, when niggas be cool, it's like, why you can't be cool again? You know what I mean? Why you can't be cool again? Me yeah. and Draco, we was cool before the beef. Yeah, it's I was like, going to ask not, you that. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like, why not be cool? Like, you know what I yeah, mean? Why not they, be cool again? Did the motherfuckers be give you flack for that too? Because when he got yeah, out, yeah, you know, bro, you know what I'm saying? What's the deal? But, you know what I'm saying? Um, um, uh, with that, um, I understand why people gave me flack. Mm-hmm. At first I didn't. At first I was like, damn, like nigga, it's like some rap shit. But then, you know, it was a lot of people hurt because they they lost somebody. Yeah. And, you know, I'm a member. So it's like, damn, bro, we love you. You know what I mean? Like, why are you what the fuck, bro? And they thought it was cause of me. They thought the whole shit was cause of me. And it's it's not. You know what I'm saying? It's not because of me. Uh, but I understand how people are thinking, you know what I'm saying? And for the record, like, you know, I, my intention is not to, you know what I'm saying, make, you know, hurt people and make people feel a type of way mm-hmm. about this shit because, you know, at the end of the day, when you lose somebody, man, it's not, it's, it's not easy to get over that shit, you know what I mean? And we really want to, you know what I'm saying, pay respects to everybody who, who lost somebody, you know what I'm saying? Because I, lo- I lost gang homies over these years, bro. I lost gang homies, bro. And it's like, damn. Nigga had to tell me, like, nigga, what if we did? I was like, what if we did that about Melly? And I was mm-hmm. like, damn. 
Mm. But you're not one of those rappers that let the politics fuck with your music or you know that, interfere nah, with what you got politics going don't, on. Nah, bo- politics don't, sh- don't, don't nudge me. Politics don't. Um, I don't let politics get in my business because this is a business. You feel me? The politics is when we over there and we're handling that. You know what I'm saying? But you know, at the end of the day, like we still, we still men, and we still gotta stand on certain things. I just wanted the world to know, like you know, what I'm saying, like it ain't no beef with me though. That's what I was coming from. That's what really where I was coming from. I was like, bro, it ain't even no beef with me. I ain't even on no beef shit. I want some like get past this and let's move forward. You know what I'm saying? Let's like you know, let's like let's just move forward. Mm-hmm. Let's let's get money and you know what I'm saying feed our families because at the end of the day, when you beefing and shit, that's money. You know what I mean? You gotta pay for certain things. You know what I mean? That's that's bread. That's expensive. Like, well, you had, and so it's like you know, if if I can't, you know, I can't even help y'all. I can't even help niggas if I if I'm worried about a war. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. let's 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 focus on this money so I can help the community and feed the community like I'm supposed to, like God want me to do. You know what I'm saying? When you had said, um, I watched the city switch on who they changed on me for. Were were you talking about Draco? Yeah. You feel like the city changed on him? Yeah, and they changed on him too. In what ways though? I feel like it's LA though. I didn't understand that though. It's LA. That's what mm-hmm. LA do. LA don't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. That's why we fuck with. That's why niggas be listening to other music. <laughs> LA don't give a fuck about you. It just is what it is. It's like a dark cloud over here. But end of the day, you got some real niggas over here too. Mm-hmm. So it just is what it is. That's just how I, that's just how I felt at the time. You know what I'm saying? And then I just watch people. Just I watch. I think it's just the fame though. Like how motherfuckers just be. You know, they fuck with the underdog. They fuck with new people. They, it's like, all right, you have four years. We was fucking with you for the four years. It's time to fuck with somebody new now. Oh, let's go to Blue Bucks. Oh, okay, let's go to somebody else. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like, did, did him dying fuck with you? Cause a lot of rappers out here right now, they dying and doing this shit. And it's, I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's fucking with me. It's yeah, fucking with like me. A lot of, I feel like Melly dying fuck it, fuck with me. You know? Yeah. A lot. No offense to nobody else, bro. I deal with a lot though, right here with, mm-hmm. with my friends, my real friends that was that will go to war for me. You know, like like a lot of people fuck with me, bro. You know, a lot of people die. We be dying out here, bro. And it's crazy. This shit is cra- out here though. Like, as far as Sunshine City, yeah. it is out here, and it's a lot that always go on out here. You feel me? And it kind of mm-hmm. it put it's put more and more of a dark cloud on the motherfucker, especially in the music too, and then the rappers like it because mm-hmm. it feel like we can't fucking get out that hole. You feel me? Like we we just gonna stay stagnant with the same shit, the same music, the same beats, and then you come over here and niggas get niggas dying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Does that affect your career as a West Coast artist too, trying to do shows and shit? Yeah, for sure. I was just telling somebody like, damn, the other day, like, damn, bro. Like, let's just make this kind of like peaceful. At the end of the day, you ain't no bitch. We know I'm not no bitch. We mm-hmm. know I can have shit going on over here in two seconds. I can have niggas this whole shit filled up. Let's just keep this shit smooth. We done already ran the money out. All right, people, we just hit 300,000 subscribers. You know we're trying to hit 400,000 subscribers. So that little red button, tap it, tap in. Appreciate y'all.